Drive on the freeways during rush hour. You probably know by now traffic is pretty much exactly to being miserable and frustrating as it was before the pandemic disrupted things. When the pandemic happened, it was weird to see all the roads empty. I know, but it was kind of nice <laughs> when you had to go out. And you've probably also noticed the traffic delays. They can really vary on freeways mm -hmm. depending on the time or even the day. This morning, Stella Sun is breaking down some brand new driving data. And Stella, we, we just got to know, do you have any advice for us and, and any details to share? Well, I would say just don't go during rush hour, but we, yes, we just got our hands on some data from the Maricopa Association of Governments and they track the amount of time commuters are stuck in traffic every day. Yes, there are people who do that. And they say the Valley's population exploded in the last few years. But thanks to some workers having those flexible work schedules, you know, some days working remote and other days in the office, the congestion levels could be a lot worse. Drivers, they can also thank the Loop 202 South Mountain Freeway for opening in late 2019 for easing some of that congestion. But annoyingly, guys, they say traffic is getting worse on this particular day. Increase uh, traffic on uh, weekends, especially on Saturday, which now sometimes compete with weekdays. He goes on to say data shows our traffic levels on Valley freeways are actually much better than in a lot of other metropolitan areas that are comparable in size.